Imagine being a 14-year-old 8th grade football player and you already know where you're going to be playing. Not just in high school, though. College, too. Zadok Dinkelman gave his verbal commitment to play college football at LSU, and he has not even played a high school game yet. Yeah, Zadok plays quarterback at Somerset Junior High. He's already six foot four, almost 200 pounds, and has a hose for an arm. Add to the fact he comes from amazing bloodlines. His father, Johan, played college football. His mom, Dee, is a Detmer, and if that name sounds familiar, she's the sister of Ty and Coy Detmer, who both had long NFL careers. Zadok is going to play for his grandpa, Sonny Detmer, over at Somerset High School, just not next season. He's going to have a year of seasoning on the freshman team first, while his cousin Coy Detmer Jr. finishes up his amazing high school career. Now, this isn't the first time a major college has offered a middle schooler a scholarship in football. USC had one commitment from a 13-year-old a couple of years back, but Zadok is the youngest commit in LSU history, and no doubt this is a highly rare occurrence. Zadok won't be able to sign his college deal until 2018 per NCAA rules, but pretty exciting if you're the Dinkelmans, knowing you've got a middle schooler who's already been offered a ride to play major college football. How did you feel? I felt, I felt amazing. It was a great experience. Why LSU? They, they just been my number one school since day one. Zadok's been an LSU fan, you know, and he's liked LSU. And I think any kid in the country that if they're given the opportunity to commit to a school that, that they love and have watched and cheer for and they're offered a scholarship, you know, if I'm not going to stop him from accepting that and making a commitment to a place like that. You know, that's, that's a dream for him. Uh, the thing that's changed the most is there's these camps now. And people go to camps. They go to, the colleges even come to town here. Well, he's gone to college camps in the seventh grade and stuff. And uh, so you get, uh, you get a lot of exposure now, and then the colleges, you know, uh, they, they're, they're paying attention to guys at about younger age. So this call was like definitely unexpected, but I don't think there's hardly, you know, people want to talk about pressure, but there's no pressure now. I mean, all he's got to do is get better, be the best he can be, and that could be real good, and uh, it's going to be real good. And, uh, and it's just uh, take that time, but as far as pressure, I mean, we always approach it as a fun thing anyway, you know, sports and stuff. And I, I think that's why our guys have always done pretty good.